Hey everyone, and welcome back to my channel, Beelicious Budgeting. My name is Anna. I'm her husband, Ernie. So today we're gonna be decorating our house for fall. I'm super excited. So if you haven't checked out our Dollar Tree haul video, we found some amazing fall decor on a budget, of course. And if you're new to my channel, welcome. I focus on content such as beauty, lifestyle, and how to save money. So if you're interested, please hit the subscribe button down below. Also, let's give this video a thumbs up. Let's just go ahead and decorate. So this is our fall decor. Majority of it is from Dollar Tree. I'll mention if it's not. But yep, we have all this to you, so let's go ahead and get started. We picked up five of these haystacks from Dollar Tree, and Ernie is really excited to do this idea across of our whole TV mantle here in the living room. Then we picked up seven of these ceramic pumpkins from Dollar Tree. I believe they're new this year. I didn't see them last year, but they're very nice quality for only a dollar. And this is what the finished product looks like. Do keep in mind the hay leaves a little bit of a mess, but nothing that my vacuum can't fix. And then this is going to be the other side. And this is what it looks like from a distance. We picked up this vase from Ross. It was $13. It was originally a bamboo color and we just spray painted it white. Well, actually Ernie did. And then we found these little fall inserts from Dollar Tree, which I thought was really cool. I really enjoyed how this turned out. So we got, hey Coco, we got four of the inserts from Dollar Tree and they had a wide range of colors. They also had some like little flower buds, but it looks very high end on a budget of course. And we just got four inserts from Dollar Tree and we're just gonna leave it by the fireplace. Then last year I was able to pick this up on clearance at Marshall's. It was only $2.50. Sorry if it's a little blurry, but it says autumn leaves and pumpkin lattes please. So I thought this is just super adorable. So I'm just gonna display it here on our Ikea shelves. So this is technically a Halloween decoration, but I think it could definitely pass for fall. Got this from Dollar Tree. It says curses and hexes. You can actually store things in there. So I like candles. If you've been on here, you'll know. But you can put like your tea lights in here just to kind of disguise them or just whatever you want. And I'm just going to put that here. So I actually got this about six years ago, even like before I met Ernie. It was 75% off at Yankee Candle and I only paid like three bucks for it. But it's really cool. You put your favorite wax melt in there and then your tea light here. So I'm just gonna put it on our coffee table. Just put it in the center of our coffee table. Of course, I'm burning my leaves candle from Bath & Body Works, one of my absolute favorite scents, just to get into the fall vibe. So Coco's gonna be helping on this one. She's just gonna observe. So Ernie's gonna do his floral arrangement. Vase, stones, and floral is, of course, from Dollar Tree. So if you saw my Dollar Tree haul video, you can tell I was definitely not doing Ernie's justice. So he sticks them in there and then kind of like blends them in together and kind of fluffs it out. So I just put the floor arrangement on our coffee table in this little tray that we got. And I'm just gonna leave it like this so it doesn't look too cluttered, but I'm really enjoying how it looks like. And our coffee table's not dirty, it's just the glitter from the glitter branches and the floor arrangement. All three of these from Dollar Tree, the pumpkin spice one and the harvest blessing hay rise one I got last year from Dollar Tree and the gather together I got this year. Someone is just over decorating already. Then I got these two from Dollar Tree. I'm just gonna put it on this tear tray that my mom got from us from Target. It was only $5. When I went back to the Dollar Tree, I found this pumpkin. So I have an orange one on my vanity table right now and I love this one a lot more. So I'm just gonna put it on top of this book. Kind of looks like a little poison apple, but I know it's a pumpkin, but I just thought it'd be cute. I was so happy to find this at just one Dollar Tree location. So I got these white pumpkins to put at the entrance. So we have C for Coco, A for Anna, me, 
E for Ernie, my husband, and then M for Marshmallow, which is right here. Hi, Marge. We put these in our entryway, so we have Ernie and I's initial on this side, and then Marshmallow and Coco's on the other, so. And this is what it looks like. I think it looks really cute and modern, so we did leave the little hooks on, but you shouldn't see it anyway, like from far away, you can't really tell. Another little tip that my husband did, so when we hung it up, it was a little cricket, so he got some tape, folded it backwards, and stuck it behind the pumpkin, so that way it's nice and straight, but for four dollars, this looks really nice and modern. So this is the final product we have in our IKEA shelf. Everything you see here is from Dollar Tree, except the autumn leaves. We got that at Marshall's. It definitely puts us in the fall spirit, vibes, whatever you want to call it. Even though where we live, it's still 90 degrees, close to 100. So of course I have to be extra. I got this from Bath & Body Works a few years ago. It's actually on clearance, so I'm just gonna change the air freshener to this festive one. Then I got this one from Bath & Body Works a few years ago as well. I know this is totally extra, but totally worth it and puts me in a good mood. Last but not least, I'm gonna put a fall scented hand soap all from Bath & Body Works. I think I'm leaning towards the Harvest Gathering. I really liked that last year and then the Perfect Autumn because these are the closest to leaves. I wish they had leaves in the hand soap, but they do not. So I'm gonna put the Harvest Gathering in our master bathroom. And I'm gonna put the Perfect Autumn in our guest restroom. I would like to add more in here, but so far I think this is really nice and festive. So we got all this going on for the time being. This is the finished product. I definitely want to add some more stuff, but for some reason, California's Dollar Trees are taking forever to release the fall decor. But I like what we have so far, just kind of simple, but still festive. We are officially in the fall mode. I absolutely loved how everything turned out. I'm definitely in the fall spirits. I love how the majority of these things are from Dollar Tree, so very easy and affordable. And if you like videos like these, let me know in the comment box down below. And if you haven't already, please hit the subscribe button. Also, let's give this video a thumbs up, and I'll see you all in my upcoming videos. Bye, everyone.